at the Rick Furco Classic. It's showtime! Zeb Wise down the bottom of the racetrack at one and two. He'll slide up and Cap Henry into the lead out of turn two. Cole Macedo on the move on the inside of the racetrack. Goes the inside of Wise for the second position. Wise going to try to cut underneath it, but Cole Macedo will take second. And big wheel stand out of Zeb Wise. Macedo second of the line. As Cap Henry starts to run away, here comes Zeb back on the high side. Tyler Courtney runs in fourth and Danny Dietrich fifth. Cap Henry pulling away slightly. Great battle for second, though. Zeb Wise and Cole Macedo. Heavy and thick lap traffic for Cap Henry as we come down to complete lap number six. Oh, red flag! Red flag! Turn two, 35, Stuart Brubaker, the car upside down here at Fremont this year already. We're back to green through the real geese decoys, orange cone. Cap Henry will pull away out of turn two. Cole Macedo in second. Tyler Courtney's committed to that bottom groove, gonna try to make it work. Zeb Wise up top, Courtney down to his inside. No surprise to see Craig Mintz pick up a couple of spots on the restart. He'll start to move the Real Geese Decoys Orange Co or the Real Geese Decoys 09 forward a couple of spots as Danny Dietrich challenging Tyler Courtney and Courtney keeps the heat on Seb Wise. Big move for third by Tyler Courtney. Wise tries to cut underneath of the top two and all-star owner points going one and two into turn two. What a race for that third spot. Tyler Courtney finally got off the bottom of the racetrack in one and two and has taken the third spot. Wise under pressure now from Danny Dietrich. Drives it in hard in three and four. Slides up in front of Zeb Wise for that four spot. Tyler Courtney is all over Cole Macedo for second. Courtney way up the racetrack. Loses two colors and here comes Dietrich. Second, third, fourth, and fifth. Run nose to tail into three and four. Wow. Tyler Courtney going to take the second spot away at the start finish line. Move the 7BC into second. He'll slide across the nose of Cole Macedo and set his sights on the tail take of the 33W. Cap Henry picking off the lap cars one by one. Halfway home this time by. Danny Dietrich got some company in Zeb Wise. Look at Dietrich though, drives it in hard in three and four. Cole Macedo has a big run off the high side of turn number two, but he, or turn number four, but can't make the move. Tyler Courtney gets the high side and here comes Danny Dietrich, catfish in the bottom. Zeb Wise gonna try to make a move on him for four. His Dietrich closes on Macedo for third. Cap Henry pulling away out front once again. Oh, hang on Zeb or excuse me, Cole Macedo got really high there in three and four. Look at Danny Dietrich to the outside of Tyler Courtney and now Zeb Wise to the outside of Dietrich. Zeb tried the way, way high side. Is Dietrich gonna go after Sunshine for second? Danny Dietrich on the move, float the bottom. Here comes Zeb trying to close in on him, but Dietrich gonna go after Sunshine for second in turns one and two. Right behind them, look at Chris Windham, Cole Macedo, and Buddy Kofoid on the move. You know what's interesting, as slick as Fremont's got, nobody's moved that big top wing back yet. As Cap Henry leads, look at this race for second though. That's exactly what Cap Henry's gonna want to see if he had a rear view mirror. As Zeb Wise got a challenge there for the third spot. Zeb trying to get on the podium as Dietrich has a big run down the back stretch. Is a slider coming for second? Yes it is, Danny Dietrich gonna slide Tyler Courtney. Courtney comes right back underneath him. Exactly what Cap Henry wants, a battle for second as he can start to try to run it high. Now Cap Henry's moved that big top wing back to the trunk. He'll get five flanges in the air, five laps to go. Caps pushed the lead over one and a half seconds. It was 1.634 last time, now 1.702. As Tyler Courtney trying to fend off a hard charging Danny Dietrich. Dietrich gonna go right by the 7BC, move Dietrich into second. Four laps to go this time by, oh, Cap Henry up the racetrack. Cap Henry, lucky that they're battling so hard for second. Three car battle for the lead. Oh my, near disaster for Cap Henry. Laps winding down here, three to go. Here comes Danny Dietrich on the bottom of the racetrack in three and four. Dietrich had one stolen from him two years ago on the final quarter here at Speed Week at Fremont. Can he get by Cap and get a little bit of redemption? Cap Henry leads him this time by. Brian will be two laps to go and Danny Dietrich's coming. Here comes Dietrich on the bottom. Boy, he gets a run into the bottom of turn number three and they are side by side for the lead. Dietrich rolls the bottom, slides up to the middle. Can he get a big run down the back stretch? Will Cap come down to the bottom? Here comes that big run in the three to the inside of Cap Henry. The white flag in the air. We got another burn burner. Is Cap going to go down to the bottom? Final circuit here. Lap track in front of your Cap Henry off the racetrack. Drag race down the back stretch, side by side for the top spot. Henry oh, tries Henry. to chop it. He, he chops him off in the three and four. Checker flag in the air. What a move for Cap Henry. They cross over. Danny, Danny, Danny Dietrich. Dietrich. Oh, my. What a, oh my gosh, what a battle. Holy cow.